So for homework question 16.45, we're asked to find our lead concentration in a solution of lead 2 phosphate. So lead 2 phosphate is PO4 3 minus. So what does lead phosphate look like? Well, the 3 comes down there, the 2 comes down there. Lead phosphate would be um, PB3, PO4, 2. So when that ionizes, right, we're going to get three lead pluses, lead two pluses aqueous, and we're going to get two phosphates, PO4, three minus aqueous. So the KSP for that would be the concentration of lead cubed times my concentration of phosphate squared. All right, I'm going to plug in X now for those. So lead would be 3X, phosphate would be 2X. So and I know my KSP. My KSP is 1 times 10 to the minus 54. They told us that at the start. That's going to equal 3X cubed times 2X squared. So I get 1 times 10 to the minus 54 equals 27 x cubed times 4 x squared. Multiply those two together, and I think I get 108. x to the fifth, All right? Divide both sides by 108. And we get x to the fifth equals, so 1 times 10 to the minus 54, divide that by 108. All right, tiny number, the minus 57. Take the fifth root on both of those. And I get x equals 6.8. 2, 1 times 10 to the minus 12. Um, if your calculator, right, if you don't have that capability or depending on your calculator, the same thing as doing the fifth root would be taking that 9.26 times 10 to the minus 57 and raising it to the one fifth. That would be the same thing as taking the fifth root. So depending on your calculator, you may not have that, that ability we found X, X is 6.2 times 10 to the minus 12. We're asked for lead concentration. What is lead concentration, right? Lead is three X. So my lead concentration equals three times 6.2 times 10 to the minus 12. My lead concentration equals 1.8 something. Yeah, 1.86 times 10 to the minus 11. Um, based on the information given us, I would say two significant figures. So I'd say 1.9 times 10 to the minus 11 is gonna be my concentration of lead in solution. For the exam, you might not see one that's this complicated. Um, you would definitely see up to four X cubed. I don't think I would go up to 108 X to the fifth. Um, for something like this.